Hi, my name is Kapil Rawat. Uh, welcome to my life page. Uh, today I am going to talk to you about decision management. Now, decision management was my first job straight after MA in economics from Jawaharlal Nehru University. I was campus placed into GE. Uh, GE is one of the largest companies in the world. Uh, I started working in an in a division called JKS Analytics. So, JKS Analytics was a subdivision within GE Financial Services. You basically look at data, you do some analysis, and then you come up with insights which are going to help the business. First thing is econometrics. All right. So, if you have done some amount of coordinate geometry, uh, then you would know this uh, this uh, image in front of you. It is basically saying that there is a y axis and there is an x axis, and there is a line on it. All right. This is what you learn in coordinate geometry. But then, if you see that there are a lot of dots in it. So, uh, for a moment, let's assume that there is some way of measuring success in life, and that's the y axis. And then there is some way of uh, saying how uh, how qualified what is the education of a particular individual, and that's the x axis. So, I can have data points of 100, 1000, 1 million people, and they would be basically dots on this graph. And then I can put a line on this graph to say that this line is more or less representative of uh, the relationship between education and uh, success in life. So, I can come up with an equation which says y is equal to 2x plus 3, which basically means success in life is equal to 2 times the education plus 3. Uh, all right. So, this is what econometrics is. So, econometrics analyzes data and then say that how best I can represent this data, maybe in the form of a straight line, maybe in the form of a parabola or maybe in the form of whatever. So, I figure out a method of representing that data and uh, then I create a model. So, y is equal to 2x plus 3 is a model and with this model, I can now predict uh, how successful or unsuccessful a particular person would be if I have their education. So, this in, in a nutshell is econometrics. So, it is a combination of uh, economics, mathematics and statistics, analytical ability. This is an analytics job. So, you need to be good at analytics. You need to be able to good at analyzing things. Uh, I would take an example of problem solving. Uh, problem solving is a relatively straightforward thing. There is a bigger problem. You break down into smaller pieces. You analyze each and every piece, come up with a solution of the smaller piece and in doing so, you have solved the larger whole. It is intellectually stimulating. This is a job where you need to require your brain all the time. You are doing analytics, you are analyzing things. So, you this is really, really intellectually stimulating. So, every each and every time you are sitting over there looking at data and saying how do I analyze it, all right. So, to me, uh, this was the biggest positive about decision management. Recommendations are not always accepted. I can be extremely candid with you. 90% uh, of my analysis actually went straight to the dustbin, right? And when I was doing that 90% of the analysis, I had a lot of faith in them and I had put in a lot of analytics, a lot of brain into them. But then you are somebody who is providing the analytics. You are not the person who is actually deciding on that data or deciding on that analysis. So, the business manager can say that, okay, I agree, I may agree or disagree or I may agree to disagree with your particular analysis, but this is how I will run my business. Uh, that is one problem, one very big problem. Uh, a typical day in the life of decision manager is data, data and more data. Uh, I would, uh, so let me remember, when I used to work at GE, I used to normally get up at 5.30 in the morning, go to the gym, get ready for office, reach the, uh, reach the office around 9.30, 10. And uh, first thing to do was uh, some kind of reporting. So, I would do my regular reports from 10 to almost uh, up till lunch. Uh, after lunch, I'll come back. US would start getting up, so I'll get a get into a conference call with my manager. Uh, we will discuss the business. Uh, he will ask me to pull some more data, do do some more analysis. Uh, that analysis might be ad hoc in nature, required for short term, or it might be something uh, which can become which might become regular reporting going ahead. Uh, after the con call, I will start working on that ad hoc analysis. Uh, most likely, we will have some kind of a meeting within our own group and analytics and we will discuss about some analysis that somebody has done. Uh, the day would end with a coffee with friends. So, that is my take on decision management. Uh, I hope uh, I have been able to provide you some understanding of decision management and uh, keep looking at my life page. Thank you.